guys, welcome, welcome back to another exciting, exciting episode with GC Central. What will give you all the exciting gist and update on the entertainment space. Like, I'm really, really loving how um, most bloggers, most especially, most bloggers are really fighting for Sonia and so on. Now, it was brought to my attention um, yesterday when um, Gist with Julie actually made um, a consign about Sonia Uchi, about a um, somebody, a commenter who has been commenting, saying ill things about this particular, um, um, about Sonia Uche. Now, in my previous video, I made something about, I mentioned a name known as Bodun and Choko. Now, I don't know if maybe it's just aligning. Now, I made something because of Bodun and Choko actually made some heavy allegations against Sonia Uche, saying that um, Sonia Uche has not been, or she's 33 years, she hasn't been married because of her bad attitude and so on. Now, okay, I was feeling like, okay, this is one of the hate speech. Now, I haven't really drawn, or it hasn't really drawn to my notice about this Bodu, but I know of Choco so well. Choco has been saying a lot of things about um, Sonia Uche lately. I don't know if it's they are trying to um, act so defensive or whatsoever. Now, Jesus Julie really made a video yesterday, and I couldn't make it because of I was having some network issues um, on my own side. So, she said something, and I was seeing screenshots. I was seeing... Um, screenshot of comments that this particular person that this particular um commenter known as bodun is saying <laughs> hey and i was so happy when she said that um bloggers should come together bloggers should actually make a sensitization against this particular commenter because this is not an ordinary thing at all it is not an ordinary thing these are people that tend to send death threats and whatsoever they are actually harmful forget me most people that they will come under the cover of um, um the lord is my shepherd or christianity and start hiding most persons are wolves in sheep clothing hmm. so guys i'm going to be um, doing um, some sensitization on my own part Um, for those of you who haven't seen the video on um her youtube channel so i'm going to be doing the video here please and please please and please if you know you do not that's why i keep on saying that we should be constructive with our comments we should be really constructive with our comments now she gave um some screenshot that i was really so shocked when she said something like this that so the, that the, the one that really got me so laughing i was laughing about it was and i was so angry was the one she said that so Uche is the number one as wood um so 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 workers all these illicit <laughs> hey god <laughs> like you look sonia from head to toe <laughs> like even if you're not close to her even if you're not close to her even if you just saw her for the first time you go to her instagram handle or you go to her facebook handle and everything that is the least that's it that is the least thing to say about sonia uche please now please that is the least thing you can say about sonia uche we've seen sonia grow from i don't know if we were following sonia uche back then when she acted and um, she was acting most of these um village girls and so on we like if i was not really a fan of sonia uche then but i just loved her movie i love how she delivered her role one of the movies that i watched about sonia uche that really got me interested in her was the one she acted frank's village wife with Jem, jerry williams i was so happy like i was so cracked up about sonia now that one she, that thing she said that sonia Uche is the number one um uh, this thing worker in asaba wood hey see that is that is something that you are not even supposed to say you can't even you can't even compare it you can't even put the whole contraction now one thing is that um i respect mommy uche nancy because of she has brought her dot it is not easy to raise girls it is not easy at all it is not easy to be a single parent it is not easy at all that woman has raised her children to the extent that people now look to, people now commend them people now um make relations um, with them to other people to emulate from them now remember when sonia uche and um, there was some kind of news going around sonia uche being buying a house and so on and so forth which was not conf which hasn't been confirmed through now somebody said he's actually a popular influencer on facebook and he said that we should look at this girl sonia uche that sonia uche happens to be one of the 
decent Nollywood actress. And anybody, like anybody who has come through Sonia Uche or who have, who have passed through Sonia Uche or seen her or even gone through her page, we will know that Sonia is one of the most decent Nollywood actress that you will get in Nigeria. You will get in um, Nollywood as a whole. Because this girl, um, there are many. Sonia Uche is a very beautiful lady. That if she wants to, if she wants to get into all this um, Asaba Wood shit, it's going to be easy for her. It is going to because Sonia Uche has the face, she has the height. But Sonia Uche tends to stay on her own lane. Make sure that she is working tireless. Look at her now. She's launching on her own YouTube channel. How many Nollywood actresses have you have you seen? Yeah, it is only few of them that you see working um like this, tirelessly like this. It is very few. Now, Sonia Uche doesn't have any BBL, no scum form of any surgery um thing that or any saga. <laughs> Since I know Sonia Uche, Sonia Uche has never been associated, never be associated to any scum. Saga or anybody calling now and say, As soon as you stole my man, Sonia, you did this, Sonia, you did that. Now, that is one thing we should respect. Put some respect on baby girl's name, I uh, put some respect on her name. Like that one, the one I saw that comment, I was so. I was so flabbergasted. I was like, ah, what is wrong with this particular person? And when she said that, um, her comment, or I went to her page on Instagram, and it was actually on private. <laughs> I said, hey, you know what you've done. You've, they've actually called you out. Now, this is also a warning to other people. Apart from her, this is a warning to other people. Please, if you're, if you're making comments, make comments constructively. Don't start saying words. Or that. Now, if, let me tell you something. Mm? If legal actions wants to be taken, Sonia can actually take legal actions against this particular lady. Yes, she can actually um, um, she can actually sue her for defamation of character. Because how will you come out on a public platform where we have millions and millions of people going through? And you say something like that about her. Sonia Uche is a very peaceful person. I'm telling you guys, she's very, very peaceful. Because if it's some Nollywood actress or some people you try this rubbish with, hey, my dear, you'll be pleading in prison. You will bring certificates and evidence to show where you saw or where Sonia Uche is dragging um, um, your husband with you. And I even saw that the woman is married. Please, please, I want to ask, what did Sonia Uche did, um, do to you? What? Because the way people are keep on narrating things, this is actually a social media platform where people are actually allowed to air their own views. But make it constructive. You don't start blabbing or start saying things you don't know just because you want to make somebody feel bad or you want to taint somebody's name. We don't do that here, please. We are actually fan base trying to grow our community and somebody is here throwing tantrums, throwing hate words and everything to Sonia Uche. It is not nice. It is not fair at all. It is not fair. If you know that, okay, this person doesn't suit it, suit with you, it is either you leave or it is either you stay and watch. You don't have to start throwing, um, throwing tantrums and saying that um, Sonia, Uche, Sonia Uche did this, Sonia Uche did that. Ah, ah, please now. And the woman is married though. Come, um, covering under the the name of, of, of Christianity. It is so, so appalling. To womanhood, it is so, so appalling. Because why would you come out, please? I'm asking myself, why would you come out to say something like this? Sonia Uche has been working tirelessly. People will feel like, okay, she started now. She didn't start now. Sonia Uche gave us a background of where she has been coming from. She told us a story. I don't know if you people heard about the story where she said that people see her now and they feel like eh, she's all perfect, she's all good. That's <laughs> When she started, it was not like this. When she started, she found it so hard to be in the acting space. When she came out from school, um, she was she left her poetry business and she wanted to get into acting. That it wasn't hard for it was really really hard for her. She couldn't get into character. At times she would cry. At times you have to cry because she couldn't get a simple line that they gave to her. She had to cry before her mom was always. Her mom was always the one gave um, encouraging her, telling her that that is how it is. Before she started growing and growing and getting better. She's getting better day by day. Please, have you seen where Sonia Uche is? Um, or any, any scandalous art you see with Sonia Uche? Please, we should all be constructive with our words. If you want to say things, and please, please, and please, we should try in as much as possible to be very, very constructive. I keep on saying it. Be very constructive with your comments on the comment section. So, please, thank you, and God bless.